All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am doing my absolute best to remain positive and hopeful, but my PayPal is no longer working, and I've got like 14 hours left in this fundraiser to save Thor News, and so I opened a Venmo account, www.venmo.com, and my actual name, T, my first name is just the letter T, I don't know if you knew that, it's true. My middle name is Eric Dash Lewison. Or the thing that is always important or that can't be messed with is 5430 Birdwood Road, apartment number 416, Houston, Texas 77096. It's going to take a miracle to save me this time because the forces that have been trying to knock me offline have worked harder this month than I've ever seen. And I don't know. So if you want to save me, and be my angel or have other ideas please let me know because i've done everything i can to bring you great information be funny inspirational and i've just been getting this shit kicked out of me it's like i don't even know man okay so it is stormy all over and it's going to continue to get stormy all over although right now there is a mild lull um the severe weather is going to pick back up later into the evening for the middle of the united states and then we got Storm after storm after storm, wave after wave after wave, rolling in from the West Coast. And so, it is going to get soggy, and there's going to be some severe weather around, and there are going to be more problems that we're going to have to deal with, and challenges. All right, where am I at? Let me get this thing, because this thing kind of shows... This is what we're looking at right now. Over the next seven days, the biggest wet weather is going to be from North California through Oregon, Washington, into Canada, and then Louisiana, Alabama, parts of Mississippi, Oklahoma, Nebraska. Wait, that's not Nebraska. What is that? Arkansas. Looks like you guys are going to get the heaviest stuff. And as you know, we have a huge complex of flooding rivers through this area and the spring outlook has been extremely deadly or extremely floody and that they i know they've done reports on the weather channel saying that the predictions are this is going to be a very 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 bloody bloody spring and you know i i've been disappointed in the overall media coverage of the catastrophic situation we have going on in the midwest with the crops and the people and the lives. And I can only pray for a miracle, though, as your planetary defense commander getting the shit kicked out of me all the time. Some days I'm, I'm sure miracles are sure are possible. But, like I said, I'm trying to remain hopeful. This is the next 48 hours. And so, as you can see, our storm will grow and increase as it gets to the middle of America. And then it will expand out. And we are in a wave after wave after wave pattern that is not going to stop anytime soon. And as you can see, we have severe weather potential for the Texas, Arkansas, Texarkex four corners, and then possibly Alabama and Mississippi. So we will keep an eye on those. And so, boy, oh crap. Now we'll watch the. I don't know, I'm just trying to, it just feels like no good, no place for good men. Although I know there are a lot of good men out there, it's just, everyone says, nice guys finish last. Well, that sucks. And eventually that would make the world a horrible place, and nobody wants that. As you can see, our big storm is going to be pushing through. It will start to expand tomorrow through all of our problem areas and then push out over the whole coast clear out on Saturday as the next storm is already rolling through creating more problems as it rolls over the same areas and the upper hose will stay on California the north part of California Oregon throughout and then we have our volcano I saw BP did a video on Popo saying that Washington put out a thing saying that the ash from the 
Mexican volcano is causing problems. Yeah, probably because it's been, as I've been covering that, it has been spewing for about three months. And super thanks to RC. I'm going to do a volcano video later if I can. Um, but it's definitely, we're definitely going through a stormy period. And it's just going to get stormier. Uh, well, my hopes for us all working together is a little low, seeing as how the, the people who want depopulation, the people who want to call the population seem to be winning at all corners and are kicking the shit out of me with nobody interfering with them. So that seems like a really bad sign. But sometimes tables churn and I have full faith in God. Though, man, I'm tired of getting the shit kicked out of me. I'm sure you guys are tired of hearing it. I'm sure like a year ago, a year and a half ago, it was way more funnier. I sure miss my sense of humor. But look at the size of these rain bands, man. They're giant. And they're getting bigger. And this... And it's almost like the tilt of Eris, Planet 9, whatever you want to call it, Planet 10, is causing a secondary equatorial moisture line from Mexico, goes up through the Gulf, and then it clears out, and then it moves over towards Europe. You know, look at these flying V things, man. Look at these flying V things. The heck, I don't even know if they're going to cut off the audio on this thing. Like they've been doing lately. I don't know, man. It's dark night of soul for me. So we got storms moving through for a little bit, everybody. Definitely something to pay attention to. I recommend now more than ever working together. But I don't know if that's ever going to happen. What if I wasted all my time trying to get people to work together? What? Oh, oh, I gotta try and avoid being negative. Anyway, I love you guys. And even if they do knock me offline or I go homeless, I did my best. Hopefully, we'll get them the next time around. So, I love you. And if you do want to have any suggestions on how I work this out, maybe you can try my Venmo. Most important thing is, or the clearest way is through my mailbox. Though, technically, tomorrow's when I gotta pay rent. The landlady said I wouldn't get kicked out till like Monday. So, I don't know, I'm pretty down, and uh, I love you guys, and I've done my best. That's all I know how to do. Okay, everybody, stay cool.